Check it, uh. Every day we're getting it. Hey, hey, check it. Uh, uh. Put the place up. Yeah, we know what we made. Greetings, greetings, greetings. How are you all today? Good, I hope. Right, today's mod is called Instant Blocks Mod. Should appear up there in a second. What is it? Makes it to engage in craft blocks and a wand. When you put this block down and click it with a wand, it'll make a structure for you. Uh, not massively overpowered structures, but just cool structures to help you in the world of Minecraft. And uh, if it helps you in the world of Minecraft, that's a good thing. So let's get into it and have a look, shall we? First of all, I'll show you the wands. Okay? Right. So you need to craft the wands because if you put the blocks down and uh, click it with your hand, nothing, nothing will happen. Right? So there's five wands, different layers. Okay? So this, you only got two uses. Okay? So it's any wood block of redstone and a stick okay this one you can click four blocks with that's what it means four uses so that's uh three cobblestone uh block of redstone and a stick 16 uses for the gold one three uh three gold block of redstone and a stick iron is eight okay you can see that and the diamond is the big one 52 three diamond block of redstone and a stick okay and that'll give you 52 uses so your diamond one's probably your best but just to start off with you know that the redstone's not that hard to get that but you need the ones to click the blocks okay right so let's go and uh have a look at some of the blocks shall we we'll go up here go to this go to here okay here's some i prepared earlier right so these are blocks here 14 in total these are just uh instant lava instant water blocks so i'll show you them in a bit all of these can be crafted apart from this one because it says creative only which means creative only so the first one wooden house block let's have a look at the crafting recipe so it's uh, three wood, like that, two glass, a bed, birch wood, birch wood, door. Okay, that'll give you this one. What you do is, once you've crafted it, go to where you want your house. Put this just here. Get your wand out. Okay, right click with your wand. Boom, baby. Here's your house. Little, let's just, uh, oh, there's a gate here. Let's go inside first of all. Have we got anything in the chests? No. So it gives you two chests, crafting table, two furnaces like a seating area and a bed not bad a little starter house let's have a look from the outside so that's not that i won't say that's cheaty really yeah that's not that's not bad at all actually okay and that's the uh what's what's that wooden house block okay let's get another one out so uh we'll put that up here because we've done it we'll get the uh mining one and the farm one okay let's have a look at the mining one first so this is instant mine and ladder block okay so it's uh three ladders three stone sign torch and a bucket of water okay so what this one does is you go to where you roughly want to make a mine like so click it click it with your wand boom baby obviously this is a quick drop so you can drop straight down here takes you to y12 if i remember yeah y12 so you can dig down a bit further if you have to and uh, the ladder to get back out so that's that's not bad at all is it really I mean, that, I won't say that's cheating either. That's just to get you down there. You know, get your mind a bit quicker. you still got to go down there and mine all your stuff out. And the let's have a look at this one here. This is the farm. So the recipe for the farm is seeds, dirt, bucket of water, and free stone. Okay. We'll put that down just get a bit crowded now. So it might be best to put them in the ground, but we'll just put them above it for now. Cool. There's your farm. Already set up as a guy in the chest. A hoe and a hoe gives you two hoes and everything else and that, that's not bad is it a couple of seeds thing that, that's pretty cool obviously if you put it in the ground that'll be ground level okay let's go back over to the chest so house instant well mine but it's not really a mine it just gets you down to there so you can dig your own mine and a uh, farm let's put these up here right the next one is a pool a glass dome and we'll look at the uh, statues one so for the pool we're going to need is four slab three glowstone and a bucket of water so uh, we'll, we'll put the pool at the back of a house because we're posh like that so you could build it you could build yourself a pretty big town to be honest with you how quickly you know pull a few of them up. what you gotta do is change them corner blocks out you can have yourself a nice little village in no time at all so we'll, we'll put this in the ground so it's right okay right click it hey cool hey oh hey we've got some diamond boards as well hey look at that for being fancy that's just uh, that's, you know what i mean that's just pretty goddamn cool that's pretty goddamn cool i like that so that's the pool one let's have a good glass dome one yeah that's pretty good glass dome one right what do we need for the glass dome crafting recipe so it's five pieces of glass torch and three stone okay this is just a glass dome so i can't imagine it being too exciting but we'll have a look anyway 
Ah, pretty cool. You mean if you build, if you, if you, if you, obviously it gives you from where the middle block is. If you middle block up first, put that on, you can take that out. You know, put a glass dome on your houses or over your pool or whatever. Pretty goddamn cool. Okay, right. The next one is the uh, statue one. So the crafting recipe will be uh, any wall player's head. Now, how you get the player's head is like this. So it's four leather, four rotten flesh, and a bone. So you put it in the crafting table. That will give you this block here. Let's put this down. What you do is you put the block down. Right click it, it asks you what your, your player's name is, so for me it's Big Cheesecake, so I put my uh, name in here, Big Cheesecake 9, it'll find me on the Minecraft form and build my skin, press done, and there we are, I mean, hey oh, where's my glasses, <laughs> let's have a look, hey, that's not bad, that's pretty close, I mean, a face only a mother could love, but you know, let's have a look at, let's have a look. Yeah, that, that's not bad. If you had my glasses, it'd be even better, but I suppose you could add them a few details on, but not bad at all, really. Not bad at all for what that was. Okay, so that's a statue block. Let's go back to uh, the little chest. Right, so what we've got left in here now. So move these out of the way. So we've got uh, rails, escape ladder. We need this here. You need to find a spawner and put it on top of a spawner, so we'll do that in a second. We'll do that one, and we'll do this one. Right, I'll show you the, uh, let's have a look at the suction block first. So the crafting recipe is eight iron and a hopper. Okay, what this does is, if you've got somewhere, I mean, I don't know how you do it. Where do we put the pool? <laughs> uh, well, oh my God, we're infested. Right, so if you found somewhere you wanted to build oil, but it's full of water, you put this down, click it, boom, the water's gone, baby. It's all in that block now. If you kick that block again, it'll just give you one level back. Like that, okay. So that's the suction block. And the crafting recipe weren't too bad. Eight iron and a thing. It clears it out of the way. It'd do exactly the same for lava. You'd probably die but, you know, as you were doing it. But uh, in fact, yeah, yeah. I suppose you could bridge out to it, put it on top, put it next to it and it'll suck below because it sucks out the sides and at the bottom everywhere. Okay, next one is this uh, rainbow sky block. Crafting recipes like that. So it's coloured wool and diamond. This one's pretty goddamn big. I've seen this one already. Let's just go just here. We'll click this down. Now be careful if you're not in creative because it, it spawns you right at the top, right on the edge. Okay, click it. You see what I'm saying? We're right on the edge here. Now that goes all the way down. In fact, we'll jump down it because it's a bit psychedelic. This goes all the way down to bedrock and I think up to level 156 maximum build height. Pretty goddamn cool. Down at bedrock here. Cool, 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 cool. I mean, to be honest with you, you're going to get a lot of wool back even if you just use it for the wool. But, you know pretty goddamn cool link a few up and that with your mates pretty goddamn psychedelic to be honest with you you can build a good base at the bottom there i suppose let's just go out here save wasting time yeah i suppose it i suppose you can class that as being just slightly overpowered <laughs> just slightly <laughs> but anyway right next one is the uh, instant rail one okay so that's what's that six iron iron block and a stick so that, that's quite expensive. This just gives you a line of rails. Let's put this down here. I'll show you. Oh, click it. Boom, baby. So it gives you, I don't know, what's that about? 30 odd rails. Yeah, about 30 odd rails. That's not bad at all. This next one, the escape ladder. What this is, is say if you were down, uh, let's say, say you've gone down the mine. You were, we're down here. Or oh, not down the mine. See, yeah, better still. You've gone down the cave. You're moving around. You realise, oh my God, all of a sudden I'm starving. Instead of having to dig all the way up to the surface, you know, make sure you pull a torch down so the gravel don't fall on you or drown. What you do is you put this one here. Let's have a quick uh, re recipe first. Crafting recipes like that. So it's, what's that, six stone three ladders. Okay, you put this down. So remember, we use imagination. We're in a cave. We're starving. We want to get back up. Can't bother to dig back up or, uh, or a, a pickaxe is wore out. Click it. Boom, baby. To the surface. Here we come. Okay, and that'll work even if you're down at uh, bedrock. It goes all the way, all the way to the surface. That'll take you off. So if you're on a mountain, it'll go all the way to the top of the mountain. Pretty, pretty goddamn cool, to be honest with you. I don't think that's overpowered. I think that, that, that's good. That's a good thing. Save you all that digging. Uh, right, so what we had to look at. We'll look at these. Look at these. What's left? What we got left? Right, we've got the uh, grinder. So let's go and have a look at the grinder. Now, let me tell you something right about this grinder. All right, I'm, I'm telling you a lot of things today. Take an escape ladder with this grinder, because we craft this, it doesn't seem to give you a way out. Okay, right, let's have a good crafting recipe anyway. Two buckets of water, pickaxe, two glass, door, two chests, and a crafting table. So what you do is, you go in your world, let's just do this like this. So you go in your world, you're wandering around, you know, you find your little dungeon with your mob spawner in it, skeleton or zombie. 
So we'll go to just here. So we say, so all right, we found it. What you do is you go up to it, you put this on top, click it where you want, boom, baby, we're inside. Okay, but there's no way out. So like I said, bring your escape ladder with you. <laughs> Otherwise, you're going to be digging your way back up. It's only just below surface. You'll see in a second. So obviously, it's a foot. It works on a full drop. So I suppose these are just one, one hit when they finally drop down here. What I do is take your skate ladder, put your skate ladder there, click it, boom, baby, and you can get back out. Let's have a look at the structure from out here. Yeah, it is a one. So obviously, your spawner's in here. Okay, obviously, it's a, it takes them up there, drops them back down there, and then there'll be a one hit from the fall. Okay, but like I say, bring your skate ladder because otherwise, you're going to have to dig your way back. Let's have a look. You're going to have to dig your way back up. You know what I mean? Because it, it doesn't give you a way out. And that's it, really. The other two blocks. There's uh, there's this one here, as you can see, but it says creative only. That just That's just for different colours. I'll show you what it does. You can't craft this, but it just, when you put it down and put something next to it, it changes colour. Okay. And the other two are this, which is a water block and a lava block. Okay. You can craft both of them. So that's like that with diamond in the centre. And the lava one is like that. Like buckets with diamond in the centre. Okay. That's it. So, what you've got to remember to do is, before you before you make your blocks, craft your ones, okay? And then you can craft your blocks. Obviously, if you're using a diamond one, you're going to have 52 uses. If you're using a basic wooden one, you're going to only have two uses for two blocks. And that's it. That's all there is to it. So, we'll muddle through it today. Pretty, pretty goddamn cool. I like the statue thing. You can build your statue. You can build yourself a town pretty quick. Instant blocks, it's called. There'll be a download link in the description. Thank you very much for watching. You have a nice day. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one, I suppose. Take care. See you later. Bye.